Hi everybody! Today my video is about, this is week 6. It's the end of week 6 and so far I've bought, I'm down to 217 now. Um, what an intro, sorry. I just assume that everybody watching this has been watching all my other videos and we're just like best friends and I'm keeping you updated on my journey. <laughs> so if you haven't watched any videos, I've been on Phenermine, which is an appetite suppressant and also um, it's supposed to give you energy. A lot of people, it gives them so much energy. Uh, for me, it doesn't give me any energy. I actually still have to drink coffee and um, take a lot of B12 and stuff to get energy throughout the day. But so far, I've lost 30 pounds. Um, what sucks, though, is I was actually down to 214 a few days ago. Which is crazy, because since my last video, I was 220, and now I'm down to 2, well, 217, but I was 214, so that's 6 pounds in a week. But then, I started weightlifting, and I've actually added in weightlifting, uh, like, just your basic weight training in the mornings to what I'm doing. And uh, my muscles are so sore, and then the next day, I saw this huge jump in my weight, and I'm like, wait, what happened? I don't want to weight lift anymore and I looked it up and um, your muscles retain a lot of water when you lift weights because it's trying to repair them so I'm up to 217 which anyone would be happy about because that's three pounds in a week still and that means I'm still like having progress on phenamine at six weeks which is a month and a half so that's exciting um, it's just not as much as it was before. <clears throat> I still have no bad side effects, except I'm starting to be able to not sleep as well. But then again, I don't really lay down to sleep till much later, so <clears throat> it might just be me. I can't really blame it on the phenomene. Um That is what I'm working with now. Looks pretty much the same as last week. Um... This shirt used to be so tight that it would not even really fit over my stomach. I had to wear a tank top under it, and um, it just was literally constricting me. Like, I could not breathe. And now, you know, it's still tight, but it's fitting. Like, it, it's fitted for what a work shirt should be, I feel like, it, especially at a bar. So, that's exciting. So, I'm still in extra large, but I'm not morbidly stretching an extra large to the point of existence. Um... So I started at 242, no, 247, and now I'm down to 217, so that's 30 pounds in six weeks, which is pretty awesome. Um, I really, they say you should only take Phenamine for three month span, so I'm really hoping by my three months I'll be down 50 pounds, which is under 200 finally. That would be so awesome. So, um, sorry I'm moving so much, guys. Um, what I eat usually is whatever the hell I want, but in tiny moderation. Um, so before I would eat like 3,000 calories or more a day without even realizing it, I just eat, ate what I wanted to, I didn't worry about it, and I was constantly gaining every week. And now I eat 1,200 calories. Um, <clears throat> I feel like the phenomene's starting to wear off at six weeks, so I've actually been eating a little bit more, like 12 to 15 a day, which is of course why the weight loss is slower, but um, Plus, the weightlifting makes me hungry. Um, also, I added B12 shots this time, which isn't something I've been doing, and I feel like that's helping me. It got me past my stall, um, because I was stalled at 222 for what seemed like forever. So, that's my updated progress, guys. I do skating for an hour, three times a week. I eat 12 to 1,500 calories. I try to eat between 11 to 12 and no later than five to seven. So those are my time frames of, of, of eating and I eat absolutely no later than seven and no earlier than 11. So that's what I'm doing. Uh, just recently I started, cause I've been intermittent fasting and I was drinking coffee with coconut oil and creamer in it and I didn't realize that that was probably breaking my fast that I had going for me. So the past few days I've been not having anything in my coffee except a little bit of almond milk. So that can help keep you in your fasted state if you are going to add intermittent fasting to it. Um, I think that's everything. I'm also getting lax in my water. So all these things I feel like are slowing my progress. I really need to improve. But it's getting hard, you know. Um, 
but still 217 yay happy dance and hopefully next time i talk to you guys i'll be close to the two tens and getting close to wonderland that's what us fat people call it when we're gonna be under 200 pounds so this video is getting long i'm sorry i can't think of anything better um and i do lots of squats still not as many as i started do as i started this journey doing but i'm still doing them that's all no hair loss no um when i start getting leg cramps i start eating pickles and um salty things so that helps with that and i've had no bad side effects so uh, have a good day everybody and thanks for tuning in bye